I would say the big parts are really building those fundamentals um, to, to make leaders who are much more confident and capable working in different environments, and then having the experience here to test out some of these theories that they're learning in the classroom and really hone their skills here so they're much more confident and capable when they go out to lead in a joint environment or a combined environment with other nations and other partners. I think it's very great that we actually are so diverse and we have all these cultural differences in the course. And the fact that we are, in my class, people from 10 countries, I think this is really great. It was a big step forward because when you do something together, when you work something together, solving problems together, the trust is getting bigger and with trust everything is getting easier. And we're hoping the students are able to go back to their units, their nations, um, and continue to pass on some of the lessons that, they, that they've taken from here and really spread it through their units to hopefully lead from their own perspective and apply some of the principles we teach here to enable them to continue to develop their units and their countries and overall strengthen the relationships that we have as a whole. Norway have has this flat structure for over 40 years and I think it's very beneficial for me to see how different nations are interacting between officers and NCO and I think I will take that home to our transformation over to NCO system in Norway. That was a huge impact, the intercultural awareness, uh, what other guys are talking, what are their behaviors because I thought we are all neighbors and we know each other, but I was wrong. And to be honest, we came here as comrades and we're leaving as friends. <laughs>